Hey everybody, so today we're being astronomers and the purpose of today is to show you that there's more than one way to be an astronomer. You don't need fancy tools. You can do it right here in your backyard. So we're in my old backyard from when I was a kid. We came up the stairs and we're in an observatory that my dad built. How old is this thing, Dad? 20 years. So it's about 20 years old. So here's my dad, here's his fancy telescope. <laughs> and he's gonna just show us the, give us a general tour of his backyard astronomer space. So what do you got here, dad? Well, I haven't been out here much this summer, so it's not all that pristine right now. <laughs> it's a little dirty and dusty, but uh, we right. do the best we can. So this is a 14 inch Mead Schmidt Cassegrain telescope and being a 14 inch scope, it's a little bigger than what you'd normally get as a beginner scope. It's very heavy, you can't, it's not portable, you can't move it around real easily. So it kind of needs an observatory to, to uh, get the most use out of it. Otherwise you'd spend more time dragging it around, setting it up. But uh, I also have a smaller scope on top to get big, wider views of the skies. Um, so it's like two in one? Two in one, sort huh. of, on the same mount, yes. And now this thing is like GPS monitored and stuff like that, right? It has a GPS so it can set the time and the date and the location so the computer knows where to go when you tell it where to go. I see. And over here he's got like a little cupboard for his tools and probably different lenses and stuff, cabinet. This is kind of cool. It always fascinated me, fascinated me when I was little. It's like a red light. So your eyes don't get all messed up when they get adjusted to the dark light. If you use red, it doesn't hurt your eyes. And then you can still see lots of different eye pieces. Just a bunch of eye pieces, different powers, so you can see different features on different planets and filters to filter out the lights from the sky if you're in a light polluted area. Which so you can see are. better things in the darker skies. Cool. And then for the grand finale, can you show us what this cool building can do? Sure. I'm going to latch it down so the wind doesn't blow it off. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Why not delicious? Hmm? Why not delicious? So the wind doesn't blow it off. Then we just roll it So we have a view of the night sky. So you can just see around and a nice clear view of the sky. So even if you don't have special stuff, even if you just have your binoculars, you could still be an astronomer in your backyard. Binoculars work very well for seeing a lot more objects than you can see with your naked eye. There you go. Be an astronomer. Thanks for watching.